Good afternoon, friends. Uh, welcome to the mid market update uh, from the advisory desk. Uh, today has been the last day of the week. Uh, we started on a very, very good note. Uh, market opening almost uh, about 60, 70 odd points in the Nifty and um, Sensex opening by more than about 200 points. Uh, now, this is because of a couple of factors uh, playing in this kind of uh, upside move in the early trade. First, to start with it, that uh, <clears throat> in the early morning EU summit happened uh, where uh, they declared uh, that uh, it'll be a, they would make a supervisory body uh, like ESFSF, uh, which will uh, give the aid directly to the uh, bank which is in crisis. Uh, now, in this case, Spain's banks, uh, like uh, the main bank, Bankia, needs the uh, aid immediately. So, EFSF will directly provide uh, the aid to the bank. Uh, so, the sovereign rating or the uh, sovereign payment of the country won't be affected. So, this is definitely a big boost uh, as this will solve a big amount of uh, issues uh, that is revolving around uh, the European Union. On the other hand, yesterday evening uh, from the government sources, uh, even the finance ministry sources clarified that the P notes wouldn't be uh, come into the GAR. So, I mean, it won't be come under the tax net. Uh, so, that's again a big boost uh, for the P note uh, investors who are trading in the Indian market. So, these two factors uh, have led to the uh, positive uh, optimism in the market and we have seen uh, across the board buying in all these sectors led by IT, uh, real estate, metals, uh, pharma, even banking which is the top performers like uh, SBI, ICICI Bank, HDFC Bank all are by more than 2 to 3 percentage uh, today. Even real estate stocks uh, which uh, took the major amount of bat battering is now up by almost uh, between 3 and a, three to 5 percent uh, intraday. So, we're seeing a broad base rally uh, where buying is emerging in large cap as well as mid caps like Subros which is 9 percent up, NCC in which Rakesh Junjunwala hiked the stake is up by nearly 5 to 6 percent, uh, even Delta Corp. Uh, is up by nearly 5 to 6 percent. So, it's kind of uh, the buying and activity seen uh, with good volumes in all those uh, stocks. Uh, even the rupee when it opened it, it's now almost trading at 56.30. Uh, it's stronger by almost 50, 55 pesa after the news came in from the EU summit. Uh, now, day one of the EU summit is over. Uh, today is the day two. So, we need to also watch out that uh, what are the other uh, output or the uh, repercussions of the EU summit when the day 2 ends. Uh, friends, uh, as of now, uh, we are trading uh, almost up by nearly 350, 360 up uh, on the Sensex. Uh, uh, no major uh, laggard seen so far. I mean, all are into the uh, positive and the advances. Uh, we need to wait uh, for further clarity from the EU summit that uh, will uh, wind up uh, by tonight or tomorrow morning. Till then, uh, friends, uh, will remain in the positive because of the good momentum and uh, that's the news we have so far uh, we'll get back to you in the post market thank you